Hey you guys, how's it going? What's up? Today I'm combining two of my favorite things to hopefully impress and inspire. Let's do Pokemon and makeup. Put them together, what do you get? Bibbidi bobbidi me. So I recently finished the entire game, um, Pokemon Sword. Totally recommend it, very good, very fun. So I decided to use a random number generator and take the numbers from the Pokedex, one through 400, because on this game there's 400 Pokemon in the Pokedex, um, and random generate a number and do a look based on whichever number matches the Pokemon from the Pokedex. I've got my Nintendo Switch Lite right here. I've got my phone here, and we're gonna go to the random number generator and type in one through 400. Like I said, there's 400 in the Pokedex, so one through 400. All right, so we got eight. Can you see that? Are you seeing that? Are you liking that? Eight. So let's hop on here and just see what number eight looks like. All right, so I got Drizzle, which is, um, I think that's the second evolution of um, Sobble. Can y'all see that? It's basically um, like a teal or like a turquoise and then like a dark blue, a purple, and a like bright green. So I'm kind of here for this. But yeah, so I'm gonna do a look based on this little guy right here. Hopefully it turns out okay and I will be right back. All right, so off camera I went ahead and I did my brows. I put foundation around my eyes just to kind of get like a good wet base going on so that when I apply the shadows, they'll stick and show out. <laughs> so first color I'm gonna go into is gonna be green. I think green is gonna be the easiest starter color. I'm gonna go in with my disgusting James Charles palette here. She has been loved, very much so. But we're gonna go in, I'm gonna use the dark green. I don't know the names of these colors. I got rid of it, I'm so sorry. Yes, gonna go ahead and like basically etch out my crease with the colors I wanna use and blend as I go. All right, so now that I have the green kind of put down where I want it, I'm gonna go in with my Jeffree Star Blue Blood Palette. And um, sort of in between as I'm adding the blue into the green, I'm just gonna go back in with the green and just kind of marry the two together. Now I'm gonna go ahead and add some definition with everything. I'm gonna use just some really, really deep purples, greens, and blues. Just give that extra depth. All right, now I'm gonna go ahead and go in with the eyeliner on the top and then smudge a little through the bottom. I love this, I think this is dope. Are you liking that? So that's the eye. I'm gonna go off camera, do the other eye, add lashes. All right, and we're back. We've got both eyes done. Are you liking that? Are you liking that? I hope so, please tell me you like it. I went ahead and I lined my lips. I'm gonna be using two shades of the Jeffree Star Velour Liquid Lipstick. The first shade I'm gonna go in with is I'm Royalty, which is this beautiful purple. Up. 
Okay, bet. So the next shade we're gonna go in with is Doll Park. It's this beautiful, cool tone pink, and I'm obsessed with it. We're gonna just put her right on the mouth. So next, I'm gonna go in with a shadow from the Bloodless palette. The shade Pink Magic, which is this gorgeous, like, sparkly purple shade. I'm gonna pop her right on the center of my bottom lip. Oh! Oh! Oh my gosh. Are you liking that? I love this. My mouth looks moist. Alright, so the next shade I'm going to do is going to go right on my cheekbones as a highlighter. The shade right above it, Wet Jewel. Oh. Oh, wow! That, oh. I'm going to put some on my bottom lip. <laughs> That's beautiful, okay. I like this. I think this was great. I think this was a really fun little challenge, a fun little game. Um, I definitely think I did more purple than he has on him, but I mean, I used every color in his little book, and I think this was a success. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Share this with your friends on your Twitter, on your Instagram, and put this in your Discord server. If you feel like doing this little challenge, go ahead and do it. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram at the Jonathan Mills. Let me know what you think. Um, bye.